guess where we just went. I'm back. <laughs> Looks right. like salt on top of the muffins. Hey guys, it's Alexa. And Jonathan. And welcome to my channel. Today we're super excited. This is like I think the first day Duncan came out with the new holiday drinks and food and stuff. So we got the pancakes. Wait, you forgot to sing. Oh. Sing. I don't want a lot for Christmas. It's too early for this. <laughs> it's never too early for Christmas. All right, so we're back. We pulled over quickly to try out these drinks and food. What do you want to try first? A drink and then a food and then a drink and then a food? Yeah. All right. So, to start off, we got... I ordered everything that's new. Yes. This was the iced white mocha signature latte. This one? Yeah. Or toasted iced white mocha signature latte. I kind of want to try the other one. Mm, no, we can try that one first. Wait, the cold. They gave us a large. What the? The cold brew wasn't new. That was just a regular okay. cold brew. They might have a new chai latte, but we didn't. Was it supposed to try it? Yeah, you can try it. Okay. Let me try it too, don't say anything yet. What's the first word that comes to mind when you tried that drink? First word. Something that would describe this drink. You know what it kind of reminds me of? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay, some... I would say good. The first word that comes to my head is just good. What about you? Caramel. Caramel? It has so much caramel You in know it. what, I didn't even think of. It's a caramel drink. It kind of reminds me of the toasted white mocha from Starbucks. We tried that? Yeah, that's the one we always get, the white mocha with the extra caramel drizzle and all those sweet cream cold foam. That's what this reminds me of. Now that one is way sweeter. The Starbucks one. Well, the Starbucks one is sweeter, but, this is but it caramel. has a very similar taste. Like when they make it not too sweet, this is what it tastes like. Mm. Not bad. But what if you, you just want it? a coffee, just get a coffee. I, I would recommend this. Like, I like this. I would probably get it again. All right. Okay. I would rate this 8 out of 10. What would you rate it? That's good. Eight, 8 out of 10? 10? I, w I don't know if I would get the large, though. Probably medium or small because it no, is. I'll finish it. I'm thirsty <laughs> anyway. She's trying to break my window out. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So this is the peppermint mocha signature latte. I already can tell there's so much chocolate at the bottom. I don't know how you're going to feel about what this. What is peppermint? It's like minty, but it's a sweet mint. It's not like a toothpaste mint. Isn't it supposed to be green? Then? Can I try it first? Okay. <laughs> Isn't it supposed to be green? No, that's like a mint chocolate chip ice cream. I think about. No. No. You try it. I don't know. Most of the mocha's at the bottom, so all I tasted was mint. Very, very minty. If you really, this really is like, like a Christmas drink. Yes, that is very festive. Very. I want. I think that one would taste better hot. They had that one hot too. I think it would taste better hot because it's more of like a warm hug. The cold one is just not tickling my fancy. It's too much mint. Yeah. And I even though most of the mocha's at the bottom, it just not very appetizing. It's like a co an iced coffee. I don't, unless you really, really like mint, I don't know if I would recommend getting that one. Yeah, no. Right? Yeah. Probably rate it 5 out of 10. Hmm. Why am I still drinking it? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> you know what? It's so bad. It's addictive. 5 out of 10? Oh. Why is that Why mean? are you so nice? Oh, that's nice? Yeah, you're being really nice. Uh huh. I love how we say we'll do drink, then food, then drink, then food, then we try both drinks. All right, let's try these pancakes. They're kind of getting a little cold, but they're still a little warm. I am not oh, wait, sharing wait. this with you. They come with this little cute um, original syrup. So let's try it. I don't should know about you guys. It? Should we try one with the syrup and one without the syrup to really grate sure. it? Wait, I don't know about you guys, but in New York, during lunchtime, we used to get these little pancakes just like this. They look like this, but little package. Have you ever got those? Oh, in like a little yeah. package. I know what you're talking I don't think I ever got them. I either. loved it. I used to ask my friends to give me, I used to eat like three packages at a time in those. So you're you know excited I mean? about those? I'm really excited about these. Okay. Nope. Hey, 
I, I have to turn. This is mine. Please, we can try to okay. listen to him. Okay, let me try this. Okay, I'm gonna take a bite first without the okay. sauce. Cheers. Cheers. I think it's honestly really fluffy. It is really nice and fluffy. It's not like dense. I expected it to be more like a hockey puck because it's Dunkin'. Like I thought they like it's frozen. They just stick it in. It's Try good. it with the sauce first. Let me know. See, now that's a game changer to me. Yeah. It's definitely a lot better with it. But I think so, yeah. it, I think it should be hotter, right? Yeah, it came hotter, but it got cold really quick. Because I had to look for parking for 35 minutes. Nice and fluffy. You're dripping all over the... <gasps> oh, it's I'm okay. sorry. I'll wipe it up. It's okay. It's fine, it's fine. I like it, though. Me too. Another one? I do have to say, though, I'm getting kind of like... We didn't have breakfast, so... My stomach is hurting a little bit. Mm. You also got a muffin to try. Mm. Two more left. One and one each. I don't want any more. Are you sure? Mm -hmm. Have it. Okay. We didn't really review it. Really good. Nice and fluffy. Better quality than I would expect from Duncan. Why are you and shaming Duncan? Uh, <laughs> no, because usually Duncan's foods it's hit or miss. Like it's either really good or right now I think this is too much sweet for me. I'm super excited about this white. This toasted white mocha hot chocolate. That's what I'm most excited about. That's why I saved it for last. She loves hot chocolates. But they took away Duncan. Serious talk, just me and you right now. You took away the white hot chocolate when I was younger. My mom used to get that for me every day. She would pick me up from kindergarten and get me the white hot chocolate. They took that away, which I don't know why they did. Everyone loved that. If you look it up right now online, you'll see. Like people are like, where did it go? Um and they took away the cookies and cream, the Oreo hot chocolate, mm -hmm. last year. They took it away this year. That me and him really like. I that. tried that one, right? Yeah, we tried that last year, and they took it away. Oh, so yeah, Duncan, remember. like, you gotta stop. Like, leave all the hot chocolates every year. All right. Oh yeah, I forgot we got the muffin. Honestly, we probably should have asked for the muffin warmed up, but I didn't want to be difficult. I don't really love muffins, so. I like yours. muffins, but this catch. Is... Hey. I don't really like muffins. I wasn't really gonna get this. Can I throw it? Oh wait, cool. I don't really like muffins. You love muffins. I love muffins. I don't know why I said that. No, I'm nervous. Let catch me try it. it first and then no, throw catch it. Catch it, ready? Oh. <gasps> I can't. She caught it. I like Duncan's muffins a lot. I love the pumpkin spice muffin. I love the chocolate chip, the blueberry, coffee cake, everything. But this is a cranberry orange muffin, which I don't mean to sound like rude by saying this, but I feel like this is something like more of a grandma would like. Is that like offensive? I feel like a grandma would sit and enjoy this. No? It's just a fruit muffin. Yeah. A lot of people eat it. So, bon appetit. <clears throat> that sounded so hard. I'm not a big fan of cranberries, but this is pretty good. You it's love like, cranberry juice though, right? Mm-hmm. It's fruity. Just the texture of them kind of remind me of raisins and I really don't like raisins. I wouldn't get this again, but if you like cranberries and like the taste of orange and like a sweet muffin, I would try this. I'd give it like a 7 out of 10. Mm -hmm. Is that a little tough though? That's just how dunk the muffins are. The top part is hard, the bottom part is soft. Because it has the sugar on top. That's why the only muffins I like. What do this call those little ones in packages? Char. Char. What are those little ones called? Oh, the little, little bites. Little bites. Oh. It's not bad. No, it's not bad. It's, it's very Christmassy. Yeah, very Christmassy. Well, yeah. is it? Cranberries are like a Christmas thing. But the orange, too. Or Thanksgiving? No. I thought cranberry and orange would be a weird flavor, but it's like oddly refreshing. Like it honestly, mm -hmm. like- It doesn't taste bad. It's nice and- All that sweet stuff, this was kind of like refreshing. Do they have a word? It's like citrusy? It's citrusy? Citrusy. There yeah. you go. Toasted white mocha hot chocolate. How do you toast a hot chocolate? I don't know. Toast? You put it in the toaster? Haha, uh -huh. so funny. Okay. I tried. It's hot, so I kind of burnt my tongue, but. Is it good? Mm. It's good. Kind of reminds me. It tastes kind of like the regular hot chocolate. Okay, you try it. I'll shut up. 
It tastes just like the regular. No, chocolate. it doesn't. It's same thing. Creamier, and it does have a bit of white hot chocolate in it. But fun fact: my mom went to the Dunkin' this morning because she wanted to try out some of the holiday drinks, and my brother got this drink, and she tried it, and she asked the guy, and he said it's just hot chocolate, but they add white mocha flavoring to it. So that's why it tastes like the regular hot chocolate, but it does have a bit of creaminess to it. But I love this. This is my favorite one. I do oh. love hot chocolate too. I would rate this 10 out of 10. Definitely. Really? Yeah. We love Dunkin' hot chocolates. I love, mm, but this does have a bit of the white hot chocolate aftertaste that I like. Does Starbucks have a hot chocolate? Mm-hmm. I don't really like Starbucks regular hot chocolate. I think it's too chocolatey for me, okay. but this is really nice and creamy. All right, 10 out of 10, what do you rate it? 9.5 out of 10, I don't give 10s out. Mm -hmm. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Comment down below what drink you wanna try or what drink you like from the Duncan collection. Thank you so much for watching. Have an amazing day. Love you so much and as always, peace love and blessings. Bye my loves.